What's up YouTube? This is Big John from J Custom Builds. So I'm here to talk about my 2009 Electric Light Ultra Classic. I'm new to YouTube. I was inspired by a couple of young gentlemen on YouTube. So grateful to those guys. Those guys literally pulled me out of a, a, a major depression uh, when I was down from a work injury, had six pins put in my shoulder. I was in law enforcement, and which forced me to retire. I'm good physically. I'm coming back uh, even stronger mentally. But I owe a huge gratitude to those guys. So while I was laid up on the couch for for about a year and a half, almost two years, dealing with all these um, injuries from a vehicle accident from work, I you know, had so much time just to think about everything that was going on. And those guys just inspired the heck out of me. And I've restored vehicles all my life. And I, I rebuilt that 2007 Ultra Classic back there that was my wife's uncle's. And he gave it to me for a great deal about three years ago, maybe four years ago. And I wanted to put my flavor on it. So I tore it down. I'll get a video of that and maybe some pictures. I'll post them up there. But I built that even before I started watching those guys. And it inspired me so much, man. And I'm, I'm a hands-on person. I love to build things. And I'll show some of my work later on in some of my, my videos. But basically, I bought my first uh, Copart bike from uh, Redding. And uh, I picked it up in February uh, 14th and I actually finished it on May 14th. It was my first build and it was kind of tough because I wasn't, I was new to the, all the ordering from all the, the dealers and the wholesalers, you know, the ordering from Harley. I mean, I bought personal parts from Harley for my bikes, but I never had to buy, you know, just a whole bunch of stuff at one time for a bike. So all the ordering, you know, the list and everything. I went through the bias, I went through the bike, I ended up realizing that I needed more stuff. I wanted to change the bars on it and whatnot. Now, the quality of work that I wanted on my bikes, I needed to find a great painter, someone that had been doing it for a long time. So I did, I found uh, Ruel out of Hayward. He did a great job on the paint. The paint is a sapphire blue, which is on the new 2122 Acura MDXs and some of the newer Hondas that they have, the Accords. And so I fell in love with the paint and I'm like, I want my first bike to be blue. Of course, blue is my favorite color. So I'm like, I want my first bike to be blue. And so I finally finished it May 14th. And then I didn't realize how hard it was gonna be to actually build a, a website. I ended up having to build my own website. You know, of course I wanted to put the money on the bikes. I didn't wanna pay somebody, but now I realized I could have found someone probably could have done a better job and done it for a decent price but you know I it felt good to be able to do it by myself but it actually took you know the first month I wasn't giving it my heart the second month I had to give it my heart because me it was my my life you know I realized you know I have no income now you know I'm relying on my retirement and some money that I had you know saved up you know I realized I needed to get the ball rolling so I ended up uh, like I said completing the bike in May it took me up until last Friday, I'm not sure what day of the week it was, or last Saturday, about a week, week and a half ago, to actually get my website up, put out my first YouTube video, and I kind of did everything backwards too. I finished the bike and made all these videos, and then I had to learn how to download the videos on my Mac, which I'm not a Mac person. So I bought myself an iMac and learned how to use it to actually build my website. And so. It's finally done, it's basic, but of course I'm gonna add to it. I'm looking to you know, start adding mugs and, and t-shirts and sweatshirts and hoodies and whatnot. I'm working on my logo right now. I'm trying to create for my business, but I'm basically just reaching out to you guys to follow your dreams and go after what you want. And that's pretty much what I did. So um, that's my story in a short take. But anyways, I got this beautiful 2009 Electric Glide right here. If you're interested in this beautiful bike, I'm actually gonna post these videos on Instagram. I have a huge following and friendship and family members who also are bikers. A lot of law enforcement, current law enforcement, ex-law enforcement, and friends. Guys that I enjoyed riding with and haven't been out with in, in a while, and you know, about a year and a half. And so, again, if you're interested in this beautiful bike, just go to my website, or buy yourself a hat. That will be your entry into the giveaway and i'm looking to build the next bike which is actually right there three weeks ago almost a month ago i picked up that 2010 from portland and it's a 2010 street glide and it was all factory uh, flat black and 
It's a super, super clean bike. And if you like this channel and you wanna view more of my content and watch me build more bikes, which I intend to do, subscribe to my channel. Your support is much appreciated. I, you know, I'm new again, I'm trying to build my channel. And uh, I look forward, man, for you guys to leave comments or if you guys, if there's any kind of style of bike you want me to build, I mean, there's lowrider bikes, there's cholo bikes, there's uh, soft tail heritages, there's road kings, there's road glides, there's electric glides. My first bike, my street glide, I'm looking to get road glide real soon and start building a road glide. So this is my full time passion. This is my full time career now. Again, I left a secure position, early retirement, a law enforcement career so that I can do this and i want to start doing tutorials on exhaust on shock stereos engine i'm planning on doing my own cam uh, my own stage four i'm looking forward to getting to the point where i can start actually doing you know cam work and piston work and and doing these uh stage upgrades you know on my own my nephew is an excellent harley mechanic he went to school for years he worked at oakland harley for years and he's showed me a lot over the years, and that's how I'm able to do this. If I ever get stuck, I call him and he's always there for me. So shout out to you, Anthony. I love you, man. And so, again, if you're interested in this bike, please go to my website, simply purchase yourself a hat, and that's your automatic entry into the giveaway. All right, thanks a lot for your support and have a blessed day.